हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम अरमोहान एंड यू आर वाचिंग निंजा इराकी दिन आर यूट्यूब चैनल होप ओली यू ऑल डूइंग वेल गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस फॉर यू ऑल आई ट्राई माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिन सो गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे द इंफॉर्मेशन हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल निंजा इराकी दिनार न्यूज़ Today we're diving into some fascinating news about the Iraqi dinar and what it could mean for those holding this currency. Recent discussions suggest that the dinar might gradually increase in value over the coming years. This raises an important question, is it wise to keep our assets within multi-currency accounts? Let's break this down. The idea of a slow but steady rise in the dinar's value is appealing for investors. However, this scenario also brings up concerns about timing and the ability to exchange the dinar at an optimal moment. The International Monetary Fund or IMF plays a significant role in this process. It's expected that the IMF will implement regulations on the Central Bank of Iraq regarding the exchange timeline for those holding dinars outside of Iraq. The crucial question is how much time will be given to exchange our dinars? Ideally, we hope for a generous period, perhaps 6 months to a year, to allow for strategic planning and maximizing benefits from the dinar's potential increase in value. A shorter window such as 1 to 3 months might not provide enough time to fully take advantage of the currency's appreciation. For those holding dinars, this situation presents a delicate balancing act. On one hand, a multi-currency account can offer flexibility and security, allowing holders to manage their finances in different currencies, including the dinar. On the other hand, the uncertainty about the exchange timeline imposed by the IMF adds a layer of complexity. If the dinar's value increases gradually, it could benefit long-term investors who have the patience and financial stability to wait out the process. The gradual rise of the dinar is an exciting prospect for investors, but this strategy is heavily reliant on the time frame provided by the IMF for currency exchange. A shorter exchange period could pressure investors to act quickly, potentially missing out on the full benefits of the dinar's appreciation. While the potential for the dinar to increase slowly over the years is appealing, it's essential to stay informed about the IMF's regulations and exchange timelines. By understanding these factors, we can make more informed decisions about whether to keep our assets in multi-currency accounts and how to strategically plan for the future. Stay tuned for more updates as we continue to cover this developing story. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights into the world of finance and investing. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more new videos.